And um, the observatory is called LIGO and Virgo. These are essentially laser beams, so-called laser interferometers, about two and a half miles actually long, four kilometers long, at right angles to each other. And they can detect little shifts in the distance between the mirrors mm -hmm. between which the laser beams bounce, far, far smaller than the diameter of the nucleus of an atom. So tiny, tiny ripples in the fabric of the universe. By observing those ripples, we can see the collisions of black holes. Uh, we tend to see the collisions of big ones, and that's what's called a selection effect. Um, the, the big ones are more energetic, and so the gravitational waves are easier to detect. But the collisions we're seeing are between black holes that are, for example, around 30 times the mass of our sun. And the number of those collisions is, I think it's fair to say, larger than anyone would have imagined uh, before the observations were made.